Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Toasty Gamer Boutique. We're here playing Merge Dragons, and I'm back in my camp. And this video is going to be all about the Shimmer Fountains. Here, we've got these fountains here, and I've kept them trapped because I wanted to display that these are all going to give us a Sapphire Mystery Egg. So we're going to give them a little bit of space to breathe, and they're going to produce these Sapphire Mystery Eggs. So I've also got some down here. So we're going to give these fountains a little bit of space to breathe as well so here we've gotten two from those fountains this is doing great we're also getting a bunch of eggs down here we've got our first five merge with these sapphire mystery eggs there and we got that butterfly dragon as well as a tribal dragon super rare there beautiful here i'm going to give all these fountains a little bit of space to breathe we just got another sapphire mystery egg if I'm not mistaken, we have another five merge. Yeah, right here with those sapphire mystery eggs. Ooh, and there we just got two tribal dragon whelps. Awesome. Super rare there. So that's going really well. I'm going to wait for a couple more of those sapphire eggs, but we are going to merge those fountains. Um, here we're looking at these. So we've got those three. We've got these two fountains over here. And the level one fountains are going to give us those fruit tree seeds so we can tap those we can either merge them or wait for them to turn into the fruit tree saplings um and uh yeah it's going to be time to merge these beauties here so here we're going to line these up we're going to make a five merge with the level one fountain legend fountains of legend there beautiful and then these level two fountains here the ancient spring level two those are going to give us the mystery sapphire eggs as well beautiful so here we're going to wait for that second mystery egg there and we should also have a five merge with these fountains right there here i'm going to get those two fountains that we have in that area give them a little time to grow but i'm pretty sure i've gotten those sapphire eggs from there before perfect and we've got one two three four sapphire eggs beautiful so just before i merge these i'm going to go ahead and tap get those fruit tree seeds out of there just merge them real quick but i'll take the extra fruit tree saplings beautiful at the end of this video i'm going to show you what levels to play if ever you want to buy those fountains you have to purchase those with gems otherwise one of the places you can find them is in kayla's daily store every now and then but it's pretty rare so i'm going to show you the levels on the world map where you can get those awesome here we're waiting for another mystery sapphire egg but we've already got a five merge right down here awesome and there we got a cosmos dragon whelp as well as the level one midas duck birthling super rare yes yeah, stoked about getting that dragon beautiful uh here whoops these orbs we're just gonna throw those uh sell them for some coins gonna move these eggs out of the way looking great and we're going to grab one more of these fountains over here. Now, we're pretty sure there's no sapphire mystery eggs. All that's checked out. Here, we can go ahead and grab those fruit tree seeds, merge those together if we wish. Here, we can merge those. Uh, the fountains are a great way to work on your fruit trees. So here, we've got these five level two ancient springs. Perfect. So we're going to make a five merge there. And we just got two of the level three shimmer shimmering spring and these level three are going to give you the level one fruit tree saplings so no more waiting on those seeds you've got the saplings right away so that's super cool here we just got two more of the mystery sapphire mystery eggs there so there's three that down there we've got these fruit tree saplings here and next what i'm going to do is I'm actually going to do a little switch to Rooney. Here we're going to get all those saplings out. And we've got two of the level four here, but we're also going to make two more of the level four. So here we're going to switch these over here. We can merge these uh, fruit tree saplings here, merge those fruit tree saplings. And in no time at all, we already have the young fruit tree. Beautiful. And here... Well, I'm pretty sure there's no sapphire eggs there. There shouldn't be. Just to make sure, I, I wouldn't want to waste a mystery sapphire egg. Oh my gosh, there's mystery sapphire eggs coming out of there. Okay, we're definitely going to give these fountains a little bit of space. 
uh, don't want to miss out on any of those mystery eggs. Let's see. Here we're giving them all space. I'm going to move that puddle out of the way. We don't need that there right now at all. And we've got five more mystery sapphire eggs. No way. Going to merge those five together. And we got a rock dragon whelp and another tribal dragon whelp. So we're definitely going to have a merge with those tribal dragon whelp. And I'm just going to wait a little second. You never know if another mystery sapphire egg doesn't come out of there. Beautiful. And then we're going to merge these level three shimmering springs to get two more of those level seven fountain of faith. Now, the cool thing about the shimmering fountains, when you merge the level three and above, you have a chance of getting the mystery fountains, those hidden fountains. Oh, unfortunately, I didn't get one just now. But yeah, we have a chance of getting those secret fountains when you merge the level three and above. So didn't quite get one there, unfortunately, but we're still going to get some more of those mystery sapphire uh, dragon eggs right there. There's the first one. Beautiful. There's the second looking great. And now we have four of these fountains. Strategically speaking, the way I'm going to place them, I'm going to make sure they're not connected. So, you know, it's really nice to be able to group things together, but it's really dangerous at the same time. So here what I'm going to do, I'm going to have the level four spread out there. And I'm going to take the level three fountain, put it right in the center. So if ever there, I'm in that area, I don't accidentally merge those. Awesome. And here we've got one more fountain. So I'm just checking to see if there aren't any more mystery sapphire eggs in there. And we're going to bring this level one fountain of legend right in the center, filling in the gap so we don't get accidental merges and, uh, yeah, next I'm going to be working on getting those level five fountains. Still, whoop -a days still haven't discovered them yet. But when you merge level three and above, so that includes level four, you have a chance of getting those secret fountains. So I definitely want to discover that. And the level five fountain, the shimmer, the shimmer fountains, not only does it produce a mystery sapphire egg, but you can also tap on it for a young fruit tree. So no fruit tree saplings. We're skipping, whoops, we're skipping all the way to the young fruit tree there. And there's even the level six, which looks like you can merge for something glorious. Now, I'm really curious to know what that means. And that looks like all the fountains we have for now here looking good. So I'm going to go to the, uh, the world map and some levels that are great for getting the shimmer fountains are some of the secret levels. So, for example, we've got the secret of four. That hidden level is right over here. So here we've got a secret level. This is great for getting fountains. There's also uh, the secret healer's den, which is right over here. Or this is secret, the crescent. It's the secret, the healer's den. But so there's the secret of four, the secret healer's den, the secret aisles, and the secret velt alley, which have a higher chance of getting those fountains of legends. And one of my favorites, though, is Zomblin Falls 1. This is a great level for purple star farming. If you know my technique about how to get those purple gems, I know you've seen that video. So Zomblin Falls 1 is a great video to try to get those purple stars. Really easy to beat, only takes one chalice, and it's easy to complete all three quests. Now, the difference between the secret levels, they, uh, you know, they don't have the quest there. So it's uh, trickier to get those purple stars. But here, I mean, we didn't get a purple star this time, but, you know, we could have. It's rare, but you've seen me do it sometimes before on the live streams. Let's see if we don't at least get one of these fountains here. So... Normally, the fountains are in the front in between the bronze chest and the magic silver coin, so it looks like we didn't get it this time. But still, this is my favorite level, Zomblin Falls 1, to get these fountains. Now, they're going to be 25 gems each, so it is a little bit of an investment for sure. Otherwise, I've seen a better deal. The only better deal I saw for the fountains, where you could purchase them with gems, was in Kayla's daily trade here and I was able to get a level one shimmer fountain for 19 gems and sometimes she even has the level two so that's worth keeping an eye on 
in this uh, Kayla's Daily Shop here. Super interesting there. Um, otherwise, of course, you may have seen in the events, those out-of-camp events, sometimes we'll have the level 2 Ancient Spring as a reward in the events for finishing all of the 10 event quests. You'll get those three special rewards. And uh, we've been seeing, usually it's a nest of owls, uh, level 2 Ancient Spring, and the Midas Tree. So for the most part, it's a level 4. Every now and then it's a level 3. But this Ancient Spring here is definitely epic indeed. Super rare. And, uh, well, you get the Sapphire Mystery Egg as well. So um, hopefully this has answered some of your questions on those fountains there. And it's definitely a great way to help you work on your fruit trees. Um, of course, for the fruit trees, we know there's the moon chest that we can get in this menu here. The moon chest, we can get five of those, merge those into the Phobos chest, but it makes a mess. So if ever you're tired of organizing all of those moon chests and all that hard work, um, these fountains could be a great way to turbo speed your way to getting more of those fruit trees. And, you know, the good thing about the fruit trees is, well, I don't have any space here. But like, for example, the watermelon, great source of coins. The pineapple, the dragon fruit, those are all great source of coins. And they also sprout the life flowers. Like the watermelon tree will sprout the blue life flowers. Here, the level eight elder fruit tree will sprout the pink life flowers there. So that's super cool. Definitely really helpful in your game in general overall for Merge Dragons. Awesome. Uh, here, we're gonna open up this chest. Let's see what's in there. Um, We've got this over here. We've got some saplings. We can definitely make a five merge with those saplings there. Merge these young fruit trees over here. Beautiful. And we'll have a five merge. Whoops. Yeah, with those uh, small fruit trees there. Beautiful. So this is really going well. We're getting super organized over here. I'm going to keep bringing these young fruit tree back there. That's looking great. I want to open up this chest. Ooh, interesting. Uh, we got a bunch of these hero mushrooms there. Sweet. Help us work on our regular mushroom chain over here. And, oh yeah, I've got that merge of the tribal dragons from earlier, if I'm not mistaken. Let's check this out over here. Oh yeah. So here we've got a five merge with the level one tribal dragon whelps. Beautiful. Just got some level two there. Looks like we have another merge. Here we can merge these level two tribal dragon kids. Yas Queen, looking great there. That's all the merges there, but that's a little bit more dragon power. And those are pretty rare dragons, so I'm stoked about that. Beautiful. Uh, and yeah, we see a merge with those silver coins here. Let's open up this treasure chest. Ooh, there's a bunch of grass in there. Pretty good there. We're going to be able to merge the grass. The orbs, I'm just selling them for now. I don't have any uh, land to heal. So, oops, meant to sell that. That's looking good there. Uh, the prism flowers, I'm just going to merge those. Merge these over here. And open up the rest of this chest. Yeah, we've got another merge here with the dragons. What is it going to be next? The sharp dragons? Ooh, perfect. We've got a five merge here. Looking great. Gonna leave that sharp dragon egg bubbled for now. Keep some space uh, a little bit on the map here. We've got three tribal dragon eggs. That's a fourth, but still not a five merge. And then there's, oh, well, yeah, we've got five. Perfect. So here we're gonna be able to merge these, uh, pardon, toadstool dragon eggs. Beautiful. Super cute there. And I, I said tribal, we're almost at five merge with the tribal dragon eggs. Only have four right now. Um, I'm waiting for another one from the magic bean stalks here. So I've got my finger fingers crossed for those. Beautiful. The magic bean stalk is the fruit tree wonder. Um, it gives you those tribal dragon eggs, but the difference is you don't get fruit. So here, the watermelon is a really great, food, uh, great source of coins uh, that you get with the fruit there. So always, uh, you know, be considerate of your source of coins that you get from the watermelons. If your watermelon trees are a great source of coins, you might want to wait a little bit before merging them right away, before getting the magic beanstalk. Um, you know, 
great source of coins there and uh, the shimmer fountains can definitely help you get more of those water uh, watermelon trees in a short amount of time well it's still a lot of hard work but air quotes short anywho thanks so much for watching hope you enjoyed this video about the fountains this is toasty gamer boutique and i'm sending positive energies out there have a beautiful day and keep it toasty peace